So again, more work going in this Kamishi Buy Card um, Stream Deck kind of set up at the moment. But you know, all of these have got uh, the green. If you did them, um, oh, we did that way around. Um, yeah, so I've still not done the actions yet, so we're getting there though. So I've created this new little path marker holder. As you can see, there's a path marker in the back. It's actually rounded in the inside, so it's actually cut perfectly for these parts. Um, so they fit straight in there and it takes 10. Everything's all engraved in there nice and clear. So I put a bit of foam in this box, gave it a couple of labels. It's just gonna be the parts capture box That's for the uh, hash when at the end of the conveyor. So the foam's there so the parts don't get dented. This needs a way to catch them. Then we can then move them onto other areas in this box or put them into other parts boxes. But yeah, put these on the floor to the trial. Apparently, it absorbs all the oil uh, and liquid, it makes it less slippery on the floor. Try to catch the problem before it makes an even bigger one. Started doing the home for the O rings. I've added some labels for the O rings so that we know where they go. Um, Max did new home for the 3D spray. I added more spares for the 3D printers. And I did a little bit more tool organisation. Um, we're still not, you know, we've still got a lot of work to do on this. Um, but, you know, things are getting labelled bit by bit. We're getting more and more tools up there, so a little bit easier to find. We need to start grouping the tools together um, to make that a little bit better. But they're getting there. So, a little update on the improvements for the electronics area. So, we've got labels now, spatulas of all cleaned up as well now. The soldering iron is fixed now in place so it can't move around. Got restock locations for the soldering. Cable stripper and clipper home. Label the bin. Label the jig. Got a prop home for goggles, pliers, and the larger strippers. Yeah. So I lock failed a little while back, and um, I need to make some modifications to make this new one fit. Because despite buying the same, it doesn't all fit together. Um, I bought one with a thumb turn which I thought would be a lot better because that means we can lock it from the inside if we wish um, sadly I don't have the plate that goes over that but that's something we can always resolve later um, so I need to fix this into place and um, make this bigger and then I can secure this door so now we can secure our door again oh, get that out there we go Good job done we've got this lovely mess um, which I might not have time to resolve all of but this is vibrating like a bat of hell and the door's not holding anymore the vibration actually stops when the door comes away from the magnet uh, so I think there's something wrong with the transformer so let's see what we can do so I think a new power supply fixed the problem yeah so there we go all working again uh, door shuts, holds, and there's no more buzzing, which is awesome. Uh, the transformer I put in is much more powerful than the old one, so the actual magnet holds better as well. This is taking me some time, but basically if I pr press this, uh, we're going to get... Uh, it goes green. It's going to open up Facebook for the homies group, ready for me to post into it. Now, the other important bit that it actually does is it connects to our website and... Um, in puts into the database the type of card that it's pulled it's pulled to complete and it's basically given us a complete date um, now what I need to do is I need to somehow pull back from here to kind of say well you know what if it isn't complete so if I uncomplete it um, I need to be able to cancel it on here but also I need that to be able to pull um, and update these appropriately depending on what time and date I've set so uh, it's a work in progress but I'm getting there I started sorting out our showroom space, um, I did the green foliage on the side of the wall, put the speaker back in here, set the alarms etc for that so we got the alarms appropriately updated. Um, we need to sort out all our fittings in here um, and also added, um, well I gave Max's uh, test light a home and some other bits and pieces, this is going to our sailors.